Dick Levinson and Bill Link were uh, marvelously uh, alert, bright, journalistically inclined pair of screenwriters, producers. And we started working together in 1969 with My Sweet Charlie, which was the first black-white almost love relationship. It was a very unlikely story uh, about a little Texas redneck girl who hated blacks and a brilliant New York, New York um, uh, civil rights lawyer who was black. And uh, they're being forced together. I will not go into the whole story. But anyway, it was quite marvelous. And they learned that they have, they're dependent on each other's uh, cooperation to stay alive because they're both being sought for reasons. And in, uh, when she finally starts having her labor pains to have a baby, <clears throat> that has sent her into seclusion because she's trying to hide being an unmarried little 15-year-old Texas redneck. And he goes out to call a doctor. He gets nailed. And they, the sheriffs are out with dogs, and they shoot him down. He gets killed. And so it was really quite a, an amazingly powerful story and wonderfully performed by Al Freeman Jr. and Patty Duke. And uh, although the network was nervous about it, mainly because we said the word nigger several times, which was uh, not approved in those days. And um, even so, we got all kinds of awards. Patty and many others got Emmy, Emmys, real Emmys for it. I got nominated but didn't win.